like a hell cut. Howdy, y'all. All right. So today, I'm going to do a little review on this little Great Neck 24-volt half-inch gun. This thing, I've used it. It actually kicks. But for being a $70 impact, heck, I'll show you here. I got the best tools with me because I'm in Iowa right now. So got this little six lug Dakota. All right, so got this half inch torque wrench. I'll even show y'all. We'll put it about 110 foot pounds for these lug nuts. Let's see if I can do this real fast. Hold on, y'all. Back on. Set this torque crunch up real fast to about 110. Yeah. See how she does. I'm trying to set this thing up, y'all. It's kind of a pain sometimes, this tool crunch. It's not the best, that's for sure. All right, here. So, y'all can see it's marked at zero. It's at 110 foot pounds. Alright, so let's get at it. Start torquing these and breaking them loose. Okay, that one's good. Oh. Alrighty, y'all. So, as y'all can see, this is a great neck 24 volt half inch gun. Y'all saw my little clip there of breaking lug nuts loose. Battery's not even all the way charged, and you have spots for your sockets like 7 eighths, 3 quarter, 21, and a 19, or whatever. Some adapters, extensions, charger. It's got a, a little slot there with the manual. But y'all, for 70 bucks, and it breaks lug nuts loose like it's nothing. You can't beat that. It... I mean, it's definitely not the best, but it'll definitely get the job done with a lot of things you need it for, so, yeah. And, uh, y'all saw my video on the, on the ice cream cruise. Thanks for all the views. It definitely helps, y'all. And, uh, what kind of vehicle would y'all want me to take next year? I'm looking at, uh, like an S10, little square S10. The small block Chevy, small tranny, stuff like that. I'm trying to think. I don't, I don't know. And that I got, I'm not into imports at all, but it'd be a lot cheaper just to tune and stuff. This little Honda Civic, I have take it next year, something like that. But, thank y'all. I'll definitely catch you on later. Uh, y'all definitely start seeing some more videos from me working on that little Civic I got and traded them Suburbans for that and restoring my 1971 F-250. So, I'll catch you all later. Thank you.